where am I and what am I doing? Wait, let me fix my camera. I stopped by a gas station because my ass was getting flat being in traffic. I don't know how long I've been on the road, but it started raining so hard. So I had to take off my GoPro and I had to like waterproof my phone. Look, tail not so tidy. That's how my tail tidy fares. <laughs> Am I recording? Yeah. Okay. I'm crazy enough to be on EDSA on a Friday at 7.30 in an evening and it has just rained. And you know how the Philippines is? It's like instant coffee. Just add water, you have coffee. In the Philippines, you add water and you have mad traffic. I am on the bus lane. I don't know if I'm allowed to be on the bus lane, but whatever. That's the thing, you know, you might think I'm crazy to be on EDSA right now. Well, not as crazy as those in cars. <laughs> this is like what? It's a Guadalupe. This kind of traffic, I should be home in 30 minutes. Yes! You wait and see. Time on my Duke clock says 1937. Let's see what time I hit the Paranaque Speedway. Wanna bet? 30 minutes. 30 minutes with that f***ing graphic on the left side. It's not just that, I'm also hungry. I'm hungry. I'm dirty. Am I cheating because I'm on the bus lane? Well, you think I'm gonna get caught on camera being in the bus? I really don't know. Well, if you catch me, you best catch the other guy too. This is why you roll with the pack. Oh, this is Friday. Look at everybody waiting for a ride. Friday in the Philippines. To all of those of you who are watching and working abroad, do you miss this? <laughs> But I'm sure you miss the happy disposition of the people here. I mean, I'm driving here and I'm like, just trying to entertain myself and talk to myself. I'm trying to entertain you too. Hee <laughs> hee. That's scary. That was scary with the bus. No, you know what was scary? Being lost in Marikina. <laughs> Philippines. It's a nice place. I know a lot of people say it's dangerous. Maybe in some areas. No. No, I'm not crazy. I'm not like that motorcycle there. It's too close. Damn it! Okay, boss. Okay, boss. Good job. Good job. That's because that bus just stopped there to like pick up a passenger. Not good job for Mr. Miami. Is that like Miami? That's spelled in a Pinoy way. God! Let's try here. Okay. This seems like it's more doable than over there. Sorry! Sorry! You. Uh, back on the sidewalk. Back on the sidewalk. I just have to go really slow just in case some passengers come up. <laughs> Worst thing ever is running into a pedestrian. Which I have. And... I was in college driving and admittedly not watching where I was going. I was going at a slow pace and then a jeepney stopped right in front of me and was letting a passenger down. The passenger stepped down and as he stepped down, my car ran into his leg. His leg was like sandwiched between my car and the jeepney. Uh, very, very fortunate that this guy had a very strong muscle. He did not suffer a fracture. Like, thank you, God. And then I find out that, you know, he was my sister's org mate. And so the story goes. This is already Rockwell, Center Makati. Bloody hell, I can't pass. <laughs> Look at our lanes. <laughs> we couldn't even make them straight. <laughs> oh, these are sad lanes. Look at those lines, man. <laughs> I think the guy who was painting the lanes was like drunk. 
Look at that line! <laughs> oh, I'm tripping on these lines. <laughs> Another one! That's not a straight line. It's so funny. Maybe for drunk people it looks straight. <laughs> funniest lines I have ever seen. Hey, that's a nice car. Well, yeah, it's a Bentley. <laughs> I was just gonna say, like, the lights look different. Wow, an Audi. Didn't know the country had so much money. <laughs> Audi Ultra. As you can see, like, it's already super crazy. Pedestrians have already gone, like, zombie apocalypse survival mode. And they're already past that barrier. The barrier says wag bumaba dito or bawal ang tao dito. Meaning people are not allowed beyond the barrier. Buses are not allowed to drop people off there. <laughs> Nobody is paying attention to the sign. Nobody. Because this is zombie apocalypse mode. You know, survival. You know where it's so cool? Their uh, everyday commute is pretty awesome in Japan. Those people know how to line up. I've watched a concert in Japan. It's so organized. You know, after every band, you know, mid-set, you know what they're doing? Because they're busy segregating their garbage. Okay, let's go down this tunnel. I usually wouldn't pick to go down the tunnel because it gets really stuffy here. Wow, it's well lit. Hey, <laughs> good job. I think they lit this up for the APEC before there were no lights. Pretty awesome, it's lit up. It's so late, I'm so hungry. Yeah! Beep your horn! He's coming into your lane! Yeah! I'm out of that tunnel! If you were claustrophobic, I doubt you could ride there. Yay, it's Magallanes Bridge! Hey, there's UFC! Llamas versus Penn. This is my kind of pace. I'm so hungry. When I get home, I'm gonna have a bowl of sinigang. See how easy this KTM Duke is to maneuver. See how awesome being in a motorcycle is. Manyaki Speedway is like two kilometers away. I need to get a flash for my GoPro, especially for night shots, because my nightlife is happening. Wow, moon is out. You can see the moon means the rain clouds are not covering it. Or <laughs> you can see the moon, it means it's night. <laughs> really? Really gacky, really. I'm almost home. I'm almost home. La -di -da -da. Awesome! Okay. 2004. I think I made it with my trip time says has been 110 minutes that's since I got lost in Marikina so you missed out that much thank you for joining me in my ride thanks for keeping me company and I hope I've entertained you all the way peace out mother